Hello, and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program Origins 2, where Opie has made it to the Badlands. Uh, we've been in mission for one hour and 13 minutes. Uh, I believe we started rolling at 9. So it took me just a little over an hour to hit the Badlands. Uh, I would stop and save some, and I did get some seismic uh, experiments in the grasslands, but now that we're here in the bed, we are going to do some science. Let me make sure I sent yeah, let's watch our science because this is going to put us over a thousand. Uh, so let's see. First thing we do is a temperature. A lot, and you know, as much as I want to. Uh, bring all of this science back. Let's hold on to it for just a moment. Barometric pressure. Log the gravity data. We're not going to get um, all of it, even if we bring um, Opie back. <clears throat> so we're just going to send it. Uh, we're going to review the data and send it. Oh, uh, I did lose communication at one point. Uh, coming down the back side of a hill, just kind of watching my speed, I stayed about 7 meters per second. Um, gonna send that one. We're gonna leave these uh, rovers. Here. View the data. I think we're gonna have plenty battery charge for this. Yeah, I believe. So we're going to transmit this back. I think that's all we had. One, two, three, four science experiments and this, which we didn't find anything. That was, uh, there's just grass and things around. Now I just tipped over into um, the Badlands. So, there we go. <clears throat> So that is, <clears throat> well, I'm, I'm assuming that's west because we're near the, e uh, the equator on the opposite side of Kerbin. So it's almost going to be morning at the uh, Kerbal Space Center. So how much data did we get? How much science? 930. Sweet. I'm going to save that. We're going to get out of here, head back to the tracking station. Yeah, I wanted to get to the Badlands. That's just something I, I want to do every time. <clears throat> yeah, see, it's almost morning here. And where do we stand at Minmus? Our guys are wanting to come home. We need that thousand points for. Um, yeah, here we go. Greater Flats. Greater Flats. Uh, oh, there's some debris too. We can get rid of the debris. Uh, da, da, da. Mario 2. Landed at Minimus. Not sure that's it. Let's go there. We need to bring these guys home and uh, get those extra parts out of the. Uh... <laughs> Uh, okay, let's jump over. Jump over here we go. <clears throat> Valentina, Bob, and Kerman. Uh, Bob and Bill, sorry. Okay, everything looks uh, right. I mean, we got. Uh, we'll close one of these in case we have problems. We'll, uh, <clears throat> We've got everything on board. We got five experiments on board that's gonna really give us the points there. So
I think it's time to go. We've shut that off. Yeah, that is shut off. So our next thing that'll happen is that will go off, that will go off, and that will go off. Those will go off. So I'm going to give it a little bit of thrust. Probably won't need it. And we need to head what direction when we launch. Oh yeah. Yeah, we need to head that way when we take off. So F5 and save this and here we go in 3, 2, 1. Have those little boosters on there to blast us away from the. Let's see if we can roll over here. Ooh. We want to head north, we want to head north. Looking good, looking good. <clears throat> Let's kill the engines because I think I'm on the correct side. Yeah, technically we could go ahead and... Now we'll do it when we get here. We'll add a maneuver to really leave the sphere of influence of Minmus. That'll drop us down into orbit around Kerbin. Just taking a look. Yeah, that'll work. Let's go ahead and speed up time until this burn. Left our equipment down there, that's perfect. <clears throat> hold prograde. Yeah, she's not able to hold anything else uh, for this maneuver anyway. It's about a 20 second burn. Go ahead and open these back up. And the antenna, I can't find it. It's over there somewhere. Oh, no matter. Okay, here we go. We are leaving the sphere of influence of Nimbus. Valentina, Bill, and Bob doing a good job. There we go. <clears throat> I believe that has done it. Let's go ahead and speed up time. Oh, well, we got some ion collections. Good, good, good. More science, more science. We're gonna hit. We're gonna hit a thousand before we get home. Twenty. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna hit uh, we're gonna hit a thousand before we ever get home. Uh, let's go here. Add a maneuver. Slow down and come into the atmosphere of. Will we get an in uh, intercept with the moon? 
Probably not. Just slow it down to bring our periapsis down to. Oh, 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 what do we do? Got a, uh, got an encounter. It's going to throw us back out. Sometimes the moon just gets in the damn way. We can get it below. Yep, right. Right there, maybe 50. <clears throat> and then we could really uh, throw on the, burn the fuel. Okay, let's go ahead and speed up time. Got some goo observations going on. Very good. We're getting all oh, oh, we hit a thousand. We hit a thousand. We can get those parts. This mission really didn't even need to to go all the way out, but we we did it anyway. Okay, we got a burn in 23 minutes. We got time here. 22. Been a good mission. Hundred and eighty three meters per second we have one thousand four hundred and ninety. So we're slowing down. We're going to fall towards uh, the moon. Uh, I'm sorry, the uh, Kerbin. Here's here's the moon. Watching this burn here. Our periapsis of. 50. No, of 125. So, need to get that down to about 50. 56. 52 is good. We'll leave it there. <clears throat> Let's get some more science while we warp down. Yep, we've got 1,307 meters per second delta V left in this ship. More science transmitted. Three science successfully. Okay, coming inside the moon's orbit. Looking good at 50. Two. Let's get on down uh, side here. Let's work to there. Maybe we can get some more science. You can get all kinds of science just warping. That is Kerbin. We're going to be coming in on a uh, nighttime landing. See, there's some perfect times when you can leave um, Minmus and the Moon to make a daytime landing. <clears throat> perfect timing. Uh, let's get on down here. We'll warp to here. We're going to come past this asteroid. We're coming in on a higher 
trajectory down this way. Now I think I can use a little bit of this fuel to slow down and go ahead and get captured. Uh, we want to slow down. So with 160 meters per second, we can get captured and get down to um, inside the moon's orbit. Just by making a burn right here. Let's warp to there. <clears throat> No, actually, that's going to bring our. Yeah, we probably won't do that. Let's not do that. I get another one. Keeping our periapsis up that way. Now we're captured. Yep, just a little bit of burn right there, 139. I think that will do it. Just using up some of this fuel that we have so we're not coming into Kerbin's atmosphere so quickly. Doesn't have to be perfect. But it does slow us down a bit. And we could do it again and again to slow down. As we come in, our carbon periapsis is at 69. Uh, let's try that again right here at a maneuver. We just don't want to burn up as we come. That periapsis back out. Still going to give us a 69 period. 60. 51. Yeah, that'll work. 46. Let's try that one. Go ahead and speed up time. We have a heat shield, so we're not really working. Okay, a little longer burn this time. Closing our periapsis or bringing our apoapsis down. All kinds of fuel. About a fifty one thousand meter periapsis. I believe that's going to be good. I believe that's going to be good. Let's close up uh, shop here. Track these solar panels and these antennas. All right, Valentina, it's all you, girl. Let's go ahead and speed up time. We'll touch Kerbin's atmosphere at seventy thousand meters. <clears throat> We're doing 2,828 meters per second. We'll probably add just a little bit of fuel, uh, a burn, to slow us down while we're in there. We have 803.
just slowing us down even further and further. <clears throat> Don't want anything to happen to the crew. Apoapsis is at a million. Oh, here comes the heating effects. We're at 54,000. Nothing's getting hot yet. Nothing is overheating, I should say. Let's hold retrograde so that we don't. Okay, Valentina, remember the procedure. <laughs> We're just letting the engine take a lot of this heat. Promise 49. <clears throat> Our periapsis right here will be 44. Two thousand five hundred sixty meters per second. Sometimes I like to skip right across the atmosphere and then land on the other on the day's daytime side. <clears throat> oh yeah, we lost communication here. We're forty-five. Apoapsis is at 300,000, twice as high as the space station is. We're starting to come up, but can't do a crew report right now. We're over the shores. Two thousand four hundred seventy-four meters per second. We are climbing again. We have skipped. So we have one hundred ninety-six thousand. So we're climbing. <clears throat> yeah, if we can. Yeah, we'll probably land over here somewhere. Got to speed up time. There's the uh, Badlands. We could land over here to Badlands. Yep, we are landing. We're going to be landing in these deserts over here. I oh. I need to watch this, and right when we start to fall again, we'll kick the, um, we'll eject the engine bell and the fuel. God, we're gonna come in on the mountains. Yep, we are coming in. <clears throat> I'd like to hit that spot right there, wherever that is. Rather do that than to hit in these mountains. Let's go ahead and uh, burn it down. We'll cut it right here so that we hit in these. Uh, could aim south and go for a <laughs> we'll land on our rover bringing that trajectory down we'll just hit the damn bad lands after all that trouble I went through <clears throat> almost out of fuel let's go ahead and burn it up 
Oh, 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 forgot about that. Forgot we were in an atmosphere. Are we going to be able to see my... <laughs> we're at 46,000. We're going to be able to see this. <clears throat> Okay, we're coming in. Two thousand meters per second, right there we go. Gorgeous. Got the heat shield with the ablator. It's full ablator, but I always like to use a full ablator coming from Minmus, but uh, we used a lot of fuel to, uh, to slow down. <gasps> look at there! Look at there! We're just all hitting over here at the Badlands now. The rover we put at the Badlands, uh, we missed the Badlands and I had to drive up about an hour at seven meters per second, seven to eight meters per second. Okay, is there a blader? We didn't use hardly, hardly any of it. We have three parachutes on board. God, I can't believe I'm 55 kilometers from there. Oh, nope, that was garbage. It's down here. That was garbage. It was garbage from a previous launch to the Badlands. Yeah, we had to make two launches to the Badlands. Let's go ahead and speed up time. And go ahead and pull the chute. <clears throat> we'll jettison the heat shield. It'll fall to the ground as soon as the <clears throat> Go. Kaboom. <laughs> okay, we'll go ahead and speed up time and get to the ground. Six hundred meters. There goes some more explosions from the um, rocket. Reentry rockets. There's our shadow. And we're in the grasslands. We haven't had a pilot or scientist or anybody land in the Badlands, so we don't have any samples, surface samples from the Badland. Here we go, looking good. Touchdown. Okay, oh, we can do it. No. We've already got this. We're in the grasslands. All right, let's go back. Let's see what our points are here. 1,025. If I could save that just in case. Cover the vessel. So just going out to the Greater Flats with this mission uh, and crew.
netted us how much? Come on, come on, come on. 451 science earned just on that trip. But we sent a lot back as well. Uh, next. And yeah, we had a couple of level ups. So we'll go over into the science station. And this is what we were working for. We have 1,400 to science. Let's go ahead and research these. That's the um, MPO probe and MTM stage. Okay. And we have 476. Uh, we're going to need 550 for this. So, and 550 for those. So that is it. Back to Kerbin. I hope you liked the video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.